In this video, I'm going to show you how to add a login and logout link on the navigation menu of your membership site. Here, I have a sample membership site. It's a basic baking site that offers my members content to learn how to bake. If someone clicks sign up, they can purchase one of my memberships to become members of my site. Then, they'll be able to log in with the username and password they chose at registration. I want to add a login and logout link here on the top of my navigation menu, so my users can easily log in and out of my site. It'll display either login or logout, depending on if a user's logged in or not. So, for my WordPress dashboard, I'm going to go to Plugins and Add New. Then I'll search for Login or Logout menu item. It's this plugin here. I'll click Install Now and Activate. Once that's done, I'll go to Appearance here on the left sidebar and Menus. And I see an item added here on the left for Login, Logout. If for some reason you don't see it, scroll up to the top, click Screen Options, and make sure Login, Logout is enabled. Now I'll expand this menu item here and select the last option, Login, Logout, which adds an item that'll either display Login or Logout depending on if a user's logged in or not. Then I'll click Add to Menu. I'll see the item's been added to my menu. If you expand the item here, you can change the navigation label here to something like Member Login, Logout if you want it to. But I'm just going to leave this set to Login, Logout. This navigation label will be the link text that's displayed on the navigation menu. Now I'll click Save Menu. And now I just need to make one quick change. I'll go to Member Press, Settings, and the Account tab. And here, under Login Logout, I'll check Use Member Press Login Page URL. This will make it so my login link directs users to the login page for my site and not the page to log in the WordPress. And you can see here that this option, URL to direct member to after login, is set to my homepage. So when my user logs into my site, they'll be redirected back to my homepage when they do, which is what I want. See our knowledge base for more information on these options here, as well as using and customizing the MemberPress login page. Now I'll click Update Options here in the settings. Now if I open my site in a new incognito window, or a browser where I'm not logged in as my site's admin, I can see the login link added to the menu. To test this out, I'll click Sign Up and sign up with some fake testing data. Then I'll be redirected to my thank you page, so I know my test signup worked. And you can see that I'm logged in. I'll click log out, and then I'll click log in again, and I'm taken to my login page, which is set up by MemberPress by default. I'll log in with my test account that I just created, and then I'm redirected to my home page. And you can see here by the logout text that I'm logged in. I'll go to members only and account to go to my MemberPress account page as my test user to double check that I'm logged in. Then I'll click log out and see that I've been logged out again. I'll click log in one more time, log in with my testing account, and see that I'm logged back in. Now my site has a login and log out link on my navigation menu. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, be sure to like, subscribe, and check out our other videos that makes getting MemberPress up and running a breeze.